true facts about beer steins. The word stein is a shortened form of steinzukrug, which in German means stoneware jug or tanker. Today, however, stein has come to mean any beer container that has a hinged lid or a handle. A boot is not a beer stein. From approximately 1340 until 1380, the bubonic plague or Black Death killed more than 25 million Europeans. This prompted the Germans to create a lid to their mug, thus creating the first beer stein. Strictly enforced regulations concerning the quality and transport of beer in many of the German provinces resulted in a tremendous improvement in the taste of beer and also had an impact on stein making. The high cost of stoneware steins, especially after the covered beverage container law required lids, made steins worthy of fine decorative ceramic art. In the 1500s and through to the 1800s, the Potter's Guild were known to have continually pushed up the minimum standards for the quality of both the decorations and the stoneware, thus making steins increasingly attractive and desirable. By 1750, stein production increased in Bavaria significantly to accommodate the over 4,000 breweries in the region. In the late 1800s, molds were used to create larger quantities of beer steins in a shorter amount of time. Beer steins come in all shapes and sizes. By the 1900s, the historical designs became unfashionable and were then replaced by town scenes, occupational emblems, common social scenes, commemoratives of military service. With the outbreak of World War I, stein making virtually ceased, but then it picked back up again in the 1920s. In the 1960s and 70s, many types of antique steins attained high enough value that people began creating replicas and attempting to sell them as authentic and originals. In the early 1970s, Saramarte of Brazil entered the stein producing business, rapidly becoming the largest producer of beer steins in the world. The long history of beer steins and their artistic nature has led to museums and personal collecting of the steins. Surprisingly, America has been the primary market for new beer steins of most types, especially the limited editions. Growing up, my family used the large collectible beer steins to hold loose change. Imported beer steins are a popular gift from the Chicago Chris Kindle Mart. If you're thirsty, I think it's time for a nice refreshing beer, so pour it into a beer stein and enjoy it because, baby, it doesn't get any better than this. Hashtag Prost. Hey, thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Danke.